this is a brief video how well Nakamichi 680Z ZX actually can um, tune up the face you know it has out of face alignment so it's currently aligned and it's recording 10 kilohertz as you may see here and here is how stable recorded face is it's fully adjusted deck you see 10 kilohertz I can switch to 15 even on 15 it's very good very stable those a little bit movement you see is a micron dot, micron pieces of millimeter uh, it's pretty small movement it's a it can be in the good deck but so far it's a very very good deck you see how stable it is 15 kilohertz and it's simple type 1 tape use it many many times my test tape so it can adjust for any tape let's let's try let's replace this one uh, with other test tape I have so it will be that X tape Switching to the text, tuning on recording, running after calibration, and built in generator looks to be not very stable. So, parts deteriorated over time, but it's not important. Let's see results. So, it just adjusted for this tape, and it's 15 kilohertz, as you may see. This tape shell a little bit less stable for some reason, but you may see how stable 15 kilohertz are. Let's try one more tape. This time it will be TDK type 2. Switch here for type 2. Everything looks to be good. Turning on recording, turning calibration. Or you see this one is different, so we need to adjust level for the left channel. Oh, oh it's a bad tape. Let's let's forward. Yeah, see how noisy it is. Yeah, that's the levels normalized. I told you it's a test tape, so it's it's everything possible. Okay, so we tune it. Let's verify one more time. So after we set levels, we need to give her couple seconds to adjust so see it's adjusting face now it's ready let's see results for oh, this tape is not very good you see the shell is pretty bad for this tape okay you see how unstable it is and mostly probably because of the shell because we just seen like couple tapes which been running much smoother I have one more tape here, let's see if it will be better, but I'm pretty unhappy with this one. One more TDKSA. Running recording. Calibration. Looks to be almost the same. Quickly tune the face. Let's see. Oh, this one better. Still not so stable as Sony or TDKD, but much better than the previous shell. And it's 15 kilohertz. As I told you, it's just microns. So micron part, one million part of one meter can affect how stable it is. You see yourself. So thank you for your attention and have a good day.